Your star sign is Leo. And this is Motivation for Leo, August 2020 and beyond. If you believe in star signs, then to some degree, you must also believe that the universe has a plan for you. Not just any plan, but a plan that only you can fulfill. A plan for you to make your mark on the world, to inspire, to beat the odds, to make things happen that maybe even you didn't think were possible. You are more than just your sign. You are the captain of your ship. Now remember, every big dream comes with big fears. Every new dream comes with new fears. Before you can go beyond them, understand that this is a normal part of the process. This is a normal part of dreaming big and manifesting your vision. This is a normal part of doing something that excites you, that stimulates you. You see, fear is a part of that stimulation because fear reminds you that what you are going for is important, that it's valuable. We don't usually feel fear about the things that are not significant to us. We don't usually feel fear about our ability to water house plants, to fold laundry, or to do many of the things that are part of daily life. But those dreams and that vision of a life enriched by the spirit of possibility, that life, that life requires that you confront fear. You see, Fear obscures everything. If you're destined to be a great speaker, fear of public speaking will tell you not to speak. If you're destined to work with children, but you fear if you're good enough, if you can have an impact, that fear will tell you not to work with children. It will tell you you can't do things you really can because fear creates fiction. Fear creates lies. And one of the biggest lies that fear will tell you is that you can't do something that you really can, that you're not good enough, or that you will never be accepted. Understand that a life where you play small, that life is a lie. Why? Because in that life, the truth of your talents, of your gifts, Your full expression is denied. We go through life pretending that our small life is our true life, when the reality is that that small life is a fiction. Our rich, fully expressed life, that life is the truth. That life is your truth, and it's your responsibility to express those gifts. The gifts that have been placed within you. The gifts that you have been given the potential to develop and share and enrich the world with. That's why you're here. To develop that Leo fire. See, you were given Leo fire for it to burn brightly. Not for it to be hidden in a corner. Not for it to be put in a shelter where no one can see it. But for it to burn brightly and for it to guide people to a greater way of being. Understand that before you were born, human beings fought wild beasts so that you could live. Our ancestors braved harsh weather so that you could live. They built towns, cities, countries, and more. They did these things so that you could live. Not live just any life, but a fully expressed life. 
Now, there are two questions, two key questions you need to ask yourself. One, do you have a plan? And two, are you following your plan? You see, if you don't have a plan for how you're gonna achieve your vision, then your first job is to create one, to clarify your vision, to know exactly what it is you want to go for. So find the people who have done what you want to do, who have achieved the goals that you want to achieve, and listen to their advice, read their books, listen to their podcasts, watch their videos, and if you can, get them as a mentor, a mentor that knows exactly how to take you from where you are to where you want to be. Once you have your plan, the next question to ask is, are you following your plan? Are you taking that daily action, that weekly action that is required to get you from where you are to where you want to be? See, you can do this. You can get your goal, but you have to plan your work and then you have to work your plan. You plan your work and then you work your plan. You see, it's important to trust that life is working in your favor. Understand that you are magic. And what that means is that things will happen for your benefit that you didn't plan for or even expect to happen. That's what I mean by magic. That's what the magic is. Now, you can call it grace. You can call it the assistance of the divine. But understand that the more you work your plan, the more magic, the more grace, the more assistance will be added to your life. So plan your work, work your plan. Choose an attitude that says, this life is working for me, not against me. That this universe is working for me, not against me. That divinity is working for me, not against me. And understand that there is a community of people just waiting for you for you to serve them with your gifts and your talents, with your passion, with your love. And they, they will truly reward you for that. The world needs you to shine your light, Leo. So go shine it. This is Motivation for Leo, August 2020 and beyond.